COVID-19 numbers are climbing across the country and here in the Commonwealth. Today, Virginia reported almost 3,500 new cases. Another 1,700 people are in the hospital. Hampton Roads hospitals are no exception. They're dealing with the surge of COVID patients. That means longer wait times for everyone in emergency rooms. Angelique Arantok found out urgent care centers also are seeing an influx of patients walking through their doors. Arthur Lewis of Norfolk spent 17 hours in the emergency room waiting area at Sentara Norfolk General Hospital. That's, that's unacceptable. His x-rays and treatment for a gastrointestinal issue took about two and a half more hours. I'm a patient person, but you know, uh, 19 hours and 25 minutes when a person is in severe pain, uh, Seemingly some other accommodations could have been made. Lewis tells me he was pleased by the care he received once he got into the ER, but it was his wait time along with others in the room that most concerned him. A statement from Sentara reads in part that they are not turning patients away, but like many hospitals across Virginia, they're seeing a rise in the number of COVID-19 patients. They say they're prepared to adjust and expand capabilities as needed to continue care. What's happening in Hampton Roads hospital systems has a ripple effect on clinics or urgent care facilities. We are seeing more patients coming to our urgent care centers. Barbara Smith is CEO of Velocity Urgent Care. We've heard from patients coming in who have shared with our staff and our providers that they are being redirected from the emergency departments. Patients can schedule an appointment or walk in. However, we let them know that they may have an extended wait time and patience is really important right now as our staff and providers are really doing all they can to help facilitate their care. Smith mentions they're seeing more patients also visiting their facilities because of a rising interest in COVID-19 testing services. For 13 News Now, I'm Angelique Talk.